Hello viewers, this is Clockworks and welcome to Orcs Must Die 5 Skull Guide. This is the second level, also known as the Fork. I'll be showing you how to get the 5 skulls on this map, just using the basic items that the game gives you when you first reach this level. Now, it may not be the best way, but it's how I did it. That's all I have to say. Using this method you should be able to get uh, the 5 skulls as well, however it does all depend on your skill with the crossbow as well, as you can see. Now for the first wave they will just come out of the left door, however for the second wave they will come out from the right door, and I believe on the third wave they will start coming out of both doors. Now normally when there's two doors like this you want to stack one side mainly with the traps and then just pay attention to the right to the other door just by yourself. However for this map you don't really need to worry too much since it's only the second level and you can pretty much breeze through it. Hell you could even do this map without, uh, without using uh, the traps at all. I'm most likely going to start fast forwarding these killing scenes in the uh, in the next uh, Walks Must Die video because they're getting a little bit tedious just watching me kill them. I won't fast forward them too much so that it becomes unwatchable but uh, well you'll see for yourself. As you can see what I did there I used three shots of the charged alternate fire of the crossbow. What this does is it stacks up the orcs so that they can't uh, so that the ones behind them can't get past and then when they unfreeze all of the orcs move in a huge group because orcs cannot run through each other they have to wait until the one in front has moved out of the way which allows you to uh, create large killing fields of orcs allowing nice little kill chains it's also good for com combining it with the uh, exploding barrel in the later videos as you'll see here Group them up and let them all hit the arrow wall at the same time. Bit of a fail there. <laughs> As you can see, all you need is arrow walls on this map mainly, but uh, I do place down some spike traps in a little bit. Well, looks like I was not paying attention to the left side too very well there. However, don't worry too much if they get past you because the game gives you a paladin or a knight, as you, whatever you want to call them. He's uh, sitting at the rift. You probably won't see him in this video, but uh, he's guarding the rift. So any orc stragglers that manage to get that far will just be uh, decimated by him, since he can't hold his own against mere orcs. As you can see, I I do like a bit of a uh, Symmetry. <laughs> now I don't need to pay attention to the right now because I know that big group of orcs is just going to hit those arrow walls all at the same time, which, as you can see, has just allowed me to get a 20 kill streak without even trying. And that is the end of the level. Very quick. Thank you for watching this Orcs Must Die video. I hope I hope you enjoyed it, and yeah, see you next time.